Hey guys, you're watching BPT Welding, and in today's video, we're going to be reviewing some Walter Abrasives uh, flat discs. I just picked these up because uh, they're having a little bit of a, uh, a contest. You can get a uh, Mustang out of it, and I saw it on Jake 2009 uh, YouTube channel, and I decided to pick some up. Um, these are supposed to be pretty good. They have a trimmel backing and all that stuff, so uh, I want to put these against the uh, random abrasives ones I've been using. This is not one of them. Uh, I've got some down here. These are also made in Germany. Uh, there we go. These are some of them. Random Products Advantage. And these are made in Germany. Last time I checked. And uh, these are four and a half inch discs and these are five inch discs. I can't source any of these five inch ones around here to put them against these ones. So this is what I got to do with. But. Uh, I mean, just looking at these things here, they look pretty good, pretty uh, pretty resistant to uh, wear. So um, we're gonna go ahead and try these out today. And uh, I've got a little project to work on. It's a buddy of mine's trailer. We're gonna be fixing the tailgate on it right now. And uh, he's got some of these heavy duty um, uh, hinges here made up for him. And as you can see, this is independent of the tailgate right now. So we need to weld that up. And uh, to do that, I'm going to use a flat dust to clean them up and uh, we might not be able to get all the way in there with them so I might use a, a wire wheel too but I want to see how all these do in a, a corner like that. Let's get into this video. So guys, I got the uh, hinge line back up and I got that joint ground out and the wheel's doing great so far. I'm actually really liking them. Uh, they seem to be removing a lot of metal, uh, maybe even more than the uh, random products discs I've been using before. Holds are looking good. I just slipped my hand on the gun here. That's why that 
is uh, curved a little bit there. Um, also beefed up the other one. These ones are pretty much perfect. And uh, I uh, set the machine up for 3 16 which is 21 volts and 420 uh, inches a minute on the wire feed. Um, help burn into the, uh, the bushing some. Because those are pretty thick stuff. It looks like the uh, wall on those is 3 8 or half inch. Um, the only unfortunate thing is this tube here is only about 11 gauge, maybe uh, maybe 3 16 um, Not very thick stuff, but uh, you know, welds are holding it good now. And uh, he got 15 years out of the other one. He should be able to get 30 out of these. So uh, looks like it's a wrap for the. Um, project on this thing here getting it fixed uh, I just want to say the Walter abrasives um, flat disc they're very good and uh, I'm excited to get to use them on some more projects after this um, we've got one right here you'll see in an upcoming uh, video maybe in a few weeks and uh, yeah they uh, they seem to be performing very well and uh, we will update you guys in the future once I go through the whole box I'll make my mind up on whether or not I'm gonna buy some more so uh, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe for more, and we'll see you in the next video.